now we're going to have another example how to compute tides using again the Admiralty Tide Tables part 1 now our problem here is to find the height of tide at 12 on 8 November at Standard Port so we need to extract again the Admiralty Tide Tables in part 1 to fill up the tidal prediction form so in number one, two, three, four boxes, we're going to extract 8.23 as the high water. And then low water, it's 14.40. So why do we get 8.23 and 14.40? Because we need to find the height at 12.00. 1200 is between 823 and 1440 so after we put the information in box number one box number two that is the high and low water times and height at standard port okay extracted in part one of the admiralty tide tables next thing we're going to do is to input the high water level beside 823 is 3.2 and beside 1440 is 1.4 now to get the range just simply subtract 1.4 to 3.2 it will give you 1.8 okay now for the duration subtract 1440 or 823 into 1440 it will give you 6 hours duration and 17 minutes okay but to get the height of the war in 1200 you need to interpolate because there is no exact value of 1200 in this standard port here so to interpolate Twelve hundred to get the twelve hundred value, we need to get eight twenty three and fourteen forty because it is in the middle. Okay, twelve hundred is in the middle of eight twenty three and fourteen forty. Eight twenty three is equivalent to three point two, so put it here. Twelve hundred that is the value that we need to get. Fourteen forty is equivalent to one point four. Now, to get the interpolation, 3.2 minus x is equals to x. 3.2 minus 1.4 is equals to 1.8. Now, 8 hours and 23 minutes. Ah, sorry. 12 hours minus 8 hours and 23 minutes. It will give you 3 hours and uh, 3 hours or 3.6 hours. So 1440 or 14 hours and 40 minutes minus 8 hours and 23 minutes, it will give you 6.28 hours. Okay? So to demonstrate to you how to compute it using the calculator. So 1200, put it in degrees minus 8 put it in degrees 23 it will give you 3 hours and 37 minutes just press the degrees it will give you 3.6 so there 3.6 hours okay now to get the value of x cross multiply x is over 1.8 x over 1.8 3.6 over 6.8 or 28 so x is equals 3.6 multiplied by 1.6 because you're going to cross multiply in order for x to be left 
So 3.6 multiplied by 1.8 divided by 6.28, it will give you 1.03. So this is not yet the value of our 1200. So to get that, you need to go back to subtract it in 3.2 to get the value of x. So 3.2 minus the value that we get 1.03, it will give you 2.1. So therefore, 1200 is equals to 2.1 meter. So the height of the water or the tide is 12 at, at 1200 is equals to 2.1. Okay. So there you have it.